how to promote Fiverr affiliate links on Pinterest. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can create your Fiverr affiliate account and how you can proceed with the sharing of the link. Here we are going to fiverr.com then I am going to scroll down till I see the end of the page and here under the community, this is the community section, I am going simply to click on affiliates. Here you can click on join now then you are going to sign up or uh, fill these gaps to in order to be signed up. It is very easy and simple to do. Now I have already made a account. I'm going just to um, to uh, log into my account and we will be good to go. As you can see, this is the Fiverr Affiliates dashboard. Here we have the uh, dashboard. We have the tools or the necessary tools that we need. In order to get a link from a customized uh, a freelancer or a service, all you have to do is to open up Fiverr, then you are going to search right here for uh, anything. For example, a logo designer, this is the standard one. Here we are on the Fiverr Affiliates, you click on all marketing tools and you can see here we have everything. We have uh, Fiverr image editing. We have here the banners, we have the all the promotional uh, things that we need. But this is not our uh, subject for this. We are going to click on default and deep links. Here on the default and the deep links, we are going to click on here on the dynamic or the deep link. This is the landing page uh, here, as you can see. Enter the link of the page you would like to promote. Now, let's go ahead and select a freelancer. For example, I want to, uh, uh, to put this freelancer right here. As you can see, this is the freelancer that creates logo designs. Uh, here, it, it can, he can create a lot of stuff. And I see his... Um, his work uh, very, very professional. I'm going to click right here, copy, go to the uh, Fiverr affiliate, affiliate, then click on here, paste the link right here, click on save, and as you can see, we have here the Fiverr Pro, Fiverr Sub Affiliates, Logo Maker, Fiverr Marketplace. This is the uh, things that we need to do. Here we have a link. I'm going to copy uh, this link and then I'm going to open it in a new tab and see where it will guide. As you can see here, it will guide directly to the designer that we have. And whenever a customer buy a service from this uh, uh, principal or uh, this specific freelancer that we have chosen, you will receive a commission. Now, Let's go ahead and put something in action. Here we have the uh, the seller or the freelancer ready. We have the link ready, of course, and we have the uh, Pinterest uh, account ready. I'm going directly to click on create pin. Now on the Canva, I'm going to create a pin. Pin like this, click on here and pin templates. Here we have the pins uh, that are specific for the uh, Pinterest. Click on one of them and uh, start to customize one of these. Here for example I am going to delete this photo and delete this also. I will make this, uh, let's say this background, I will make it like this purple. I will delete this and Let's go back to reassure that we are going to use the Pinterest pin. Here, Pinterest, I'm going to put Pinterest pin and see. Here we have some Pinterest pins. Let's see, this is the correct format. Here we are on the format, as you can see here. We have the correct format. This is a thousand uh, by a thousand and fifty or a thousand five hundred. Now I'm going to especially going to put here a design solution for a designer and a question mark. I'm going to put all of this, all of this, 
then I'm going to change the font of it like this, for example. Not, it's not very suitable, but I guess that I'm going to for this. I'm going to put here, search no longer, or for example, don't bother, don't, don't search anywhere else, anywhere else, like this. And here we go. This is the the title and here we have a question a action and now I'm going to put for example designs I can go ahead and uh, put the uh, designer or the the freelancer photos but I'm going to put for example designs like this and here I'm going to put right here design I meant to put here design on the elements and I can see right here some photos I'm going to add this not this one but let's go ahead and add this one as a photo like that and I'm going to see all the photos that we have let's say that we need some graphics I'm going to add some graphics like that and this also I'm going to put, for example, Photoshop, Photoshop. If I see the logo right here, we have some Photoshops. This is the Photoshop logo. Illustrator, Illustrator, like this. And I will see if I have the logo of it. Here we have. And here we are going to put, for example, this one like that and here I'm going to put a text box like this and link I'm going to put a link here and I'm going to here I'm going to design this one I'm going to put a great font for it because it is not visible on the black one I'm going to put all of this I'm going to change the font also and here we go you can put a uh, element for example arrow let's go ahead and put arrow like this and here we go I'm going to change the color of the arrow and boom this is a, a pin I'm going simply to click on this here download and I'm going to download it as a PNG this is very simple the second thing that we are going to put or use is right here go to create the pin on Canva or, or on Pinterest not Canva this is the pin here we have the description uh, I'm going to put um, designer professional let's go ahead to the title professional designer professional designer or hire for example I'm going to put this as the same description now for the link I want to put a short link not that long link that we have I'm going to put link right here short shortener I'm going to search on Google on link shortener here we have the link of the freelancer going right here enter the link shorten the link as you can see this is the link I'm going to try it right away and see if it will take us to the uh, preferred website and yes it do now I'm going simply to here click on add link and here we go you can add a board for example somewhere I'm going to put designs create this board create and you can go ahead to put on some tags designs designs here character design graphic design what is this it is not what I wanted to put but graphic design poster and we are good here now all you have to do is you click simply on publish and 
wait for the result. Click on view the pin and here we go. We have a professional design right here. We can see we use the PSD or Photoshop, Adobe Illustrator. We have these pen tools and we have the color uh, adjustment. And of course we are some designers that we work with pen, a pen and a laptop. That was very simple and easy to do. Now let's see something else. If I want to add or choose another service or another freelancer, all I have to do is simply go back to Fiverr. I'm going, for example, on the digital marketing uh, SEO. Let's go with the SEO here. We are going to use something on this one. We have this. Let's go ahead and refresh the page. As you can see here, we have a lot of freelancers. I have chosen this one. Here, all I have to do is copy the link of this landing page of this freelancer. Then I am going to the Fiverr affiliate. Remember, here we are on the dashboard. Click on Marketing Tools, Default and Deep Links. Click on Deep Links. Here we are going to paste the link. Click on Save and it will here change the details. View Details. Click on here. Verify that it is the correct link. As you can see, this is the same one. And simply create a design using Canva for it. It is not very complicated. And so go ahead and add it as a pin. Create a pin and boom, here you go. That was very easy and simple. That was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope to see you soon on the next one.